you serious? Are you serious? Well, Happy New Year's Eve. It's going to be a powerful day today. I'm going to read some scriptures. So get a Bible, get a cup of coffee. We'll be reading from the Revelation chapter 22, the last book and the last chapter of the Bible. I'll be reading from the King James Version of the Bible. Now don't forget, tonight, New Year's Eve, special broadcast, we do it every year, from 9 p.m. to midnight and beyond. That's 9 p.m. Eastern till midnight and beyond. We will bring you, Lord willing, into the year 2014. But remember, this is the Midnight Hour. Are you saved? All right, let's read, okay? Get some coffee. Revelation. Now, we are also having a show today from 12 noon to 2 p.m. So we're going to be two hours today and three hours tonight. Revelation chapter 22, the Bible says, And he showed me a pure river of water of life, clear as crystal, proceeding out of the throne of God and of the Lamb. And in the midst of the street of it, and on either side of the river, was there a tree of life, which bare twelve manner of fruit, and yielded her fruit every month, and the leaves of the tree were for the healing of the nations. And there shall be no more curse, but the throne of God and of the Lamb shall be in it, and his servants shall serve him, and they shall see his face. And his name shall be in their foreheads. And there shall be no night there. And they need no candle, neither light of the sun. For the Lord God giveth them light, and they shall reign forever and ever. And he said unto me, These sayings are faithful and true. And the Lord God of the holy prophets sent his angel to show unto his servants the things which must shortly be done. Behold, I come quickly. Blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of the prophecy of this book. And I, John, saw these things and heard them. And when I had heard and seen, I fell down to worship before the feet of the angel, which showed me these things. Then said he unto me, See thou do it not, for I am thy fellow servant, and of thy brethren, the prophets, and of them which keep the sayings of this book. Worship God. And he saith unto me, Seal not the sayings of the prophecy of this book, for the time is at hand. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. And he which is filthy, let him be filthy still. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. And behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. Blessed are they that do his commandments, that they may have right to the tree of life and may enter in through the gates into the city. For without are dogs and sorcerers, and whoremongers, and murderers, and idolaters, and whosoever loveth and maketh a lie. But I, Jesus, have sent my angel to testify unto you these things in the churches. I am the root and the offspring of David, and the bright and the morning star, and the spirit and the bride say come, and let him that heareth say come, 
and let him that is a thirst come, and whosoever will, let them take the water of life freely. For I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. If any man shall add unto these things, God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. And if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life and out of the holy city and from the things which are written in this book. He which testifieth these things saith, Surely I come quickly. Amen. Even so, Lord, Jesus, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Amen. We are nearing the midnight hour of the end of the year 2013. And in tonight's live broadcast, we will review the 12 prophecies that the Lord gave us for this year. We will look at all 12 of them and how every one of them, the confirmations of events that have taken place throughout the entire year that helps reveal to the people that are watching that truly the Lord Jesus Christ is coming very, very, very soon. Are you saved? Will you be ready? For the Bible says, in an hour you think not, the Son of Man will come. He said to watch and pray. He also said, I come as a thief in the night. And he also said that no man knows the day nor the hour. No, not the angels in heaven, not even Jesus Christ, the Son of God, but only the Father. Matthew 24, 36 and Mark 13, 32, I'm paraphrasing. So it's very important that you give your life to Jesus Christ. Don't miss tonight's show at my website, www.paulbegleyprophecy.com. That's www.paulbegleyprophecy.com. And that will be from 9 p.m. Eastern until midnight and beyond. Also on Livestream.com. Also my new Livestream channel and Blog Talk Radio. And if you want to be listening on your cell phone, you can dial the number 347-324-5208 and listen to the entire broadcast on your cell phone. God bless you and give your life to Jesus Christ. Come Lord Jesus! Even so, Lord, come quickly. Keep looking up. Lift up your heads, folks, for your redemption is drawing nigh.